Oh, 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 he's running, he's running. <laughs> Gangster. Hello, I'm Rianne and this is my husband, Ben. Malaysia! Hi guys, welcome back. We're on to Aldridge's and this is our Malaysia series. We've actually come 30 kilometers south of Kuala Lumpur to the famous intelligent garden city of Puttaraja. I'm really excited because just arriving here, it looks stunning. Yeah, it looks pretty special. So let's go and explore. I think we're probably going to go into Putra Mosque, which is right behind us. So it'd be rude not to. But this city is a planned city. It's got a population of 91,000 people. It is actually Malaysia's biggest ever construction project. Looks like Rian's got some fans. So we are now on the outskirts of the Putra Mosque. It is absolutely stunning. It's the world's first pink mosque and it is a beautiful shade of pink. I was gobsmacked when we walked inside. It is beautiful. I'm sure uh, the dome on the top is the largest in Southeast Asia as well. So it's quite a magnificent mosque and it's right on the river as well. So we're actually like on the sort of the terraced area now and we're like, overlooking the river. It's a beautiful day as well. It's like quite nice here. We literally nice. just come outside from the mosque where they were just finishing doing the prayers so we got to um, listen to that which was beautiful. Puttaraya is actually uh, known as the garden city so there's it's 38 percent of the land is actually like greenery which is quite mad there's 300 species of birds that live here as well. So, You're gonna take up bird watching? Yeah well if you live here move to Malaysia come to this city and bird watch for all your joy. Right, so we've had a little seat just outside the mosque here and just over there in the distance that's the Sari Warrison Bridge. That's a cable stayed bridge designed in that way so it stands out from the rest of the bridges. So it really looks super like modern and that connects like two like very famous mosques together. When I was doing some research on, on the city, I found out, right, this is basically Malaysia's second capital. This is where, that's where the Prime Minister's office is. So this is where like the, what would you call it? The political stuff goes on and it's also like to tourists, I'm surprised this isn't like a massive tourist attraction. It's not really, there's not many tourists here. And Malaysia's hidden gem. This is Malaysia's capital hidden in plain sight. I like it, I actually really like it. We've arrived at Taban Botani. Basically the botanical garden. Clearly it's a very beautiful garden and we're just walking along a bridge now and Rian is excited because there's monkeys. Look! Oh, she's got a baby. Oh, there's one there. Oh my god. Oh my gosh. He's following us. Is it actually? I'm getting a little bit nervous. These monkeys are like hissing at us. And following us. Look, he's following us. Look, he's speeding oh, up. Alright, let's get off here. See the shower now. Oh, he's running, he's running. <laughs> We're running from the monkeys. <laughs> Are they still coming? Nah. Oh my god. Ter territorial. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, that one on the side started speeding up. I was like, nah, you're right. <laughs> we just don't want our stuff to get stolen or get bit. Get bit on the neck or something. Oh like. gosh. We don't want to be at the hospital with hospital bills. Yeah. But do come here, it's nice. Alright, let's have a look around Again, at the nature. I'll, again, I've got to say about the uh, quietness. 
Yeah. No one else here. I oh, know, it's craziness. Yeah, this is a Friday afternoon. We'll be at five o'clock. Yep. Literally, we're the only ones here. Even when we walked in reception, I was like, you said to the woman, I said, are you open? She went, yeah, go through. To the right is a bridge and all that rubbish. She didn't tell us about the monkeys. No. Oh, I think we've got to walk back that way. It shows that we can outrun monkeys at least. It did, I don't think they really tried, did they? Did they not? No. Oh, I was just waiting for one to jump on me. I was like, ah! We always like to go to these botanical gardens because they're always just so pretty. There's so many different trees and flowers to see. And you always get to see monkeys, but I'm a little bit nervous in this one. I've seen loads. Well, we're getting outnumbered by monkeys by a million because there's no one here. <laughs> normally, we, um, we have to pay. Like, you know, Kuala Lumpur, Colombo, all these ones, they've got fantastic botanical gardens, but they always charge you. Or, and there's normally a set price for locals, set price for foreigners. This one, it's free for everyone. And to be honest, it's no, it's, it's just as good, it's massive as well. I know, I wish we caught a map though, because I'm not sure where we're going. I feel like we're going onto a road. Let's go and find something pretty to look at. Fun fact, this is actually named Asia's most amazing garden at the Royal Chelsea Flower Show. So, pretty prestigious. I'm a little bit nervous as monkeys. Okay, we're walking past loads of monkeys at the moment, and I am just not an animal person. I like cats, but anything else, I'm not, so I may run and scream. But at the moment, all we're seeing is trees. Nothing really that's really made me proud. I saw a lizard, but he ran off too quick for me to film, but at the moment, we're just scared of monkeys. Brian, did you not listen to me when I said this is one of Asia's, this is actually Asia's most beautiful garden, but according to the Chelsea Flower Show in 2008. So don't dismiss it. Well, we're actually going to move on a little bit quicker than we thought because there's a storm coming. We can just hear like thunder and lightning coming. And don't really fancy getting wet. Not like proper wet. Oh, this is the garden though. This is where we are meant to go. Now, perhaps have a look at this first. This is the area that the lady actually told us to come to. She said, take the little bridge and come down here. It's where all the different plants are. It's looking good. That's not sounding good though. <laughs> but at least the roof, at least the roof will save us. Yeah, it's hollow. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if they could, I don't know if they could see it on camera. Ben's just ordered us a grab. We're going to head towards the night market around here. It's an hour walk away. So we're like, let's just get a taxi. It's only 10 minutes in the taxi. Um, how much was it? It was only 16 minutes. So it's worth getting one and it should be about five minutes, nice and easy. And we'll show you around the local night market here, the food stand, see what it is, and we're gonna grab some dinner to take home. Hello. Market, but literally as we've turned up it's pouring down with rain so we're gonna run under someone's tent this one looks available no one's here every time typical literally as we pulled up in the taxi it like rain started coming. we're debating whether to just get a taxi on oh. it's probably the worst storm i've ever seen we're just stuck under here our feet are getting soaked now because the water is like that deep the thunder and lightning is absolutely mental it's so scary and we just realized we ain't got enough cash on us so we need to run over the street to get cash just wait a few more minutes but if this don't go we're going to just go over Good morning. Okay, it's the next day. We sort of got a little bit rained off yesterday. So we thought we'd continue this the next day. We are literally just off to get a coffee. There's a mall probably about five minutes walk away. 
and we've just sort of chilled out and done a bit of work this morning and we decided to take you lot with us take you lot with us and continue the journey this is the mall literally five minutes from us and we haven't really ventured in here much have we we've been here like a week it, there's absolutely loads there's loads of little stores in the middle selling like cheap clothes and um, there's donuts ice cream there's so much but we spotted this rotty boy yesterday when we were grabbing dinner and we're like we need to come back and try it so we've came back okay so we actually ate there yesterday snack it and we had a banging nasi lemak it could be probably our favorite yesterday's dinner uh, we're gonna get out of here to try it but these are good there's only four different flavors and we went for a mocha and a cheese so who's gonna do the best well, i'll go first but Maria said i went for the mocha i'm gonna rip it for you so see what the inside's like Download and Daya. Super rich, super sweet, really slight coffee taste, bun's like super soft and it's still warm where it's so fresh. These are like literally, if I was going to give these a mark out of 10, I would give it like a 14. I went for the cheese one. You've got like a crispy cheese topping on it and it's such a fluffy bun. Like as soon as you pick it up, it squishes. It's so fluffy. But let's see what mine's like. It's so sweet and delicious. It's like a brioche bun. Oh, and we've got like a cream cheese filling in there. It is, oh, it's unreal. These are just so fresh, light, and just like perfect to go and have with like a tea or coffee. So let's go and get one. So inside the mall, there's little stand-up coffee stands. So we went to the GG Coffee. We quite like them, reasonable price. I got a calamari tea. It was meant to be hot, but it's cold. Miscommunication. And then got a Americano. Good. I don't really like calomel cold, it's a bit funny. But we're just going to head back to our apartment and just catch up on some work. This whole point of us being in this area is just to catch up work really, but we've been filming in between because there's so much to see and do here. Yeah, I mean, we're going to do a, like a day in the life video, uh, just to say what our basic day is, like our working day. We'll show you a bit of that, so if that interests you, leave a comment below. And also the next video is going to be, there's, there's actually, it's, it's a Saturday today and there's a Saturday night market. That's Apparently a bit good, so we're gonna check that out. So make sure you subscribe. We have been to many mosques we've done, like the Taj Mahal. Oh, it's not a mosque, is it? Is it not? It's a palace. Temple. Is it? It's a palace, isn't it? Oh. Um, yeah, but sorry. Oh. <laughs> I, was <We've>... just... <laughs> I was just gonna say. Quick! Basic. We always like to go to these botan... botanical. We always like to go to these botanical. What can I say? Botan Bo botanical. So botanical. Botan botanical. Botanical. But it has got over 700 different plants from all over the world. Different. What is it? <laughs> <laughs> from from all different continents. And you've got like crispy trees. Trees? 